we will return to the adventures of Thunderbolt in, in space. space. After these words from our sponsor. Not another commercial. Hey, Oddball, let's go dig for pirate treasure in the yard. You bet. But Domino, do you think it will be okay with Mom? Yeah, no sweat. Mom and Dad will be back from their walk soon. What could possibly go wrong? Hey, Domino, what's this? That's just one of those crummy robot toys Corella de Vil is making. Who would want such an ugly hunk of junk? I'm ruined! Ruined, I say! My toys! My marvelous, splendid toys! They're selling worse than Brussels sprouts! Don't worry, Miss Deville. I'm sure this new one will be a big hit. No fool! Can't you see? The spoiled brats of England must be spending their pocket money on something else. And we must eliminate that competition. Yes, there's no other choice! Professor Farsboom! Get your head out of your toy programming and answer the phone! Uh, yes, Cruella, my sweet? Farsboom, my high-tech hireling, initiate Plan B! Hey, everybody, we're back! Mom? Dad? Hey, where is everybody? Oh, look, Dipstick. There are Oddball and Domino. At least they're still here. Listen, it's coming on the TV right now. And all over England, pets of every kind are vanishing without a trace. Scotland Yard is now on the case and... <gasps> I just can't believe it. Our puppies, gone. It's that horrid Cruella de Vil up to her old tricks. I just know it. But what can we do, darling? I'll tell you what we can do. We'll go over to that evil woman's toy factory, get our pups back, and have it out with her once and for all. You're right, Dipstick. Oh, I could just bite that woman. Now, Oddball and Domino, you puppies stay right here. Take care of our humans while we're gone and don't worry. We'll be back with all your brothers and sisters as soon as we can. Goodbye, my darlings. And be good. So, do you want to stay here and be good? Or do you want to go help rescue our family? My thoughts exactly, sis. Let's go! Hello there, puppy. Name's Waddlesworth. Welcome to Regent's Park. Hi, Waddlesworth. I'm looking for my brothers and sisters. I think they may be in trouble. Yes, Cruella de Vil has sent out an army of robotic toys to capture all the pets in England. But why? What is she going to do with them? The robots are locking the pets into crates like this one and taking them to Cruella's toy factory outside of London. Can we stop them? Of course! The toys are dangerous if you're not careful, but they are very poorly made. A loud bark at close range will destroy their cheap electronics. What about my brothers and sisters trapped in the crates? Try tumbling into the crates. You should be able to smash them open and rescue the puppies inside. Thanks, Waddlesworth. I'll see you soon. <laughs> <laughs> My mom calls me that because, well, I never stop moving. <laughs> nice to meet you, Fidget. There's a lot of fun stuff to do around here, but, but look out for those evil toys. If you have any questions, you just come find me and I'll tell you what I know. Bye now. up there. Hey, I don't know if you've found Cruella's henchman Jasper yet, but when you do, bring him back to my tree. I bet we could play a funny trick on him. <laughs> See you later.
take care, you mutt! Okay, Fidget, now what? You gotta make him dizzy! One dizzy batted coming up! Now I gotcha! Oh, look out for his neck! I'm looking, I'm looking! Whoa! That should do it! <sighs> Alright, you! <sighs> Just a real still like! <sighs> and now for the coop! The grossy. Oh, oh. I have one not a magic. Ouch! I guess Jasper got the point. In the end. <laughs> What's that? Oh, I, I lost my favorite nut. I go searching for it, but my mom doesn't let me go very far from our tree. <laughs> if you find it, would you please bring it back to me? You bet, Fidget. Kitty Cat, what are you doing here? Ahem, I am Sergeant Tibbs, and I've been sent to help you save your brothers and sisters 
and track down Cruella de Vil. What do you know about Cruella? Well, let's just say that I've done battle with that Haridan de Vil before. I'll take any help you can give me, Mr. Tibbs. I'll see you soon. <laughs> country? Out by Cruella's place? Yes, I'm quite familiar with the area nearby her filthy, decrepit mansion. Her mansion? Is that near her toy factory? How do I get there? Let's take it one step at a time. You need to get through this toy store and up to the top of Big Ben via Piccadilly Circus. The top of Big Ben? But why? From the heights of Big Ben's bell tower, you can contact the barking chain at twilight. Those dogs should be able to help you get out of London and make your way through the countryside to Cruella's mansion. Wow, thanks, Tibbs. this cannon thing is? From time to time you will find toys like this. Just run up next to them and press your action button. The rest uh, should be obvious. Is it safe? Oh yes, they are just toys. The target should be clearly visible. Shoot all of them and you will receive a bonus.
Hi again, Tips. Is that a real train? It is a scale model of an actual steam train. And you can ride it from the store if you want. That's so cool. Friend, in order to reach the exit, you must take this elevator down to the basement warehouse. How do I do that? Just walk into the elevator and press your action button. That sounds easy. <laughs> Now approaching the secret room. 
Fidget, where are we? <laughs> We're near Piccadilly Circus with lots of cars, streets, and shops. I need to get to Big Ben. Can you point me the right way? You can start by following the bus to Trafalgar Square. I'll meet you over there with more information. cover, it'll fly off. And then you can use the hole in the shark to keep it somewhere else in the lava. Cool. Thank you. 
things in the walls. It's some kind of puzzle Professor Farsboom set up here to test your intelligence. You have to pick the symbols in the right order. If you get one wrong, you have to start over. <laughs> A manhole cover just waiting to have its cover barked off. <laughs> yeah, watch this. Okay, it's open. Now for the fun part. Oh no, you don't. Slow down, you mangy mutt. You're as good as sunk. I think Horace is feeling a bit down today. <laughs> been making all the prank calls? When I get my hands on you...
Oh, hi, puppy. My name is Yvonne. <laughs> Gesundheit. Thanks. I think I've got a bit of a head cold. Hey, Yvonne. I need to get to the top of this tower to contact the Barking Chain. Can you give me any advice? Oh, sure. I know this place like the back of my wing. As you make your way up, I'll drop in every now and then with some advice. Thanks a lot for your help, Yvonne. Ride the swinging clock pendulums across the room to make it to the exit. And make sure to explore the hidden rooms on the side. Piston up to the top of the room. 
try jumping when you get close to the top. Looks like fun! Jump toward the red counterweight when it reaches the bottom of its cycle. Look around the room as you're traveling up and down, and you might find some cool stuff. Jump to the yellow counterweight. From there, you might be able to rescue one of your brothers. You can also jump on the green counterweight if you want to head toward the exit. Great! Now, make sure you explore the ledges that you can reach from this counterweight. When you're finished, come back here and then jump back to the blue counterweight. Can I get my paws on Cruella? I'm gonna... Now 
jump off onto that ledge, and you'll find a way to get to the purple counterweight. From there, you'll find a way to the exit, which will take you closer to the top of Big Ben. spinning gears to cross the gaps. You've almost made it to the top of Big Ben. Boom, I'm at Big Ben and ready to deal with the Mongols. You will be in real trouble, my sweet. The doctor is armed with my new tomato cannon. I'm going in! We're not going to be able to contact the barking chain with Cruella hanging around. We'll have to get rid of her somehow. Hmm. Maybe those rusty old catapults will still work.
Cruella's changing her tactics. Old witch is gone, we can contact the barking chain. Oh, woof! Woof! Ah, that's not loud enough to reach the barking chain, Domino. Try again. Okay. Oh, woof! Woof! Ah. Louder, Domino! Oh, woof! Woof! Ah. Hey, a volume control. <laughs> See, we got the chain started. Now all we have to do is wait for an answer. Uh, how could those vile puppies defeat me, Cruella de Vil? Oh, I know. It must be your fault. But, but ma'am, we tried to get him, but they silence. Just go get those puppies. Now! Fast boom! Is the super gloop ready? Almost, my darling. Just a few bugs to work out, and then... And then the fun begins. <laughs> I can't quite make it out. It's hard to hear. He says, go? <coughs> and meet Fluffy <coughs> at the... <coughs> Royal Museum. The museum? That's just a few blocks away. Let's go. Hi there, I'm Fluffy. Welcome to the Royal Museum. Wow! There sure is a lot of cool stuff around here. I wish we had time to look at it all, but we've got to find a way out of London. Don't worry, I'll help you find the information you need. But I'm afraid that first we have a few tasks to complete. Like what? I think Cruella's henchman Le Pelt has been prowling around here. Because a few important artifacts have been moved around. We have to put them back in their proper places before the museum opens up tomorrow. Okay. What can we do to help? The first artifact is an old coin made by ancient Romans. I need to put it back in the Roman exhibit. So would you go get the coin and bring it back to me? Okay, see you in a bit.
mistake. You brought back the coin. I'll make sure it's put back in its proper place. Here's the next artifact you need to find. This scarab is a symbol of eternal life. And it's supposed to be in the pyramid exhibit on ancient Egypt. Could you bring it back to me? Okay, we'll be right back. Ah, thanks for rescuing me. Well, there's the pelt's trap. What a joke! Anyway, even if I did get caught in there, that hole in the side is plenty large enough for me to fit through. Hey, that gives me an idea. And boy, is the pelt going to be mad. Now all I have to do is jump into that sarcophagus. Aha! Now the stick snaps, and voila! What? My ingenious trap! A failure! <laughs> ah, good! The puppy is trapped anyway! As usual, I am victorious! Now where are you, mon petit chien? <laughs> Poor lapel! Let me out! It is very dark in here! Well, at least his mummy loves him. Oh no! My shoes are getting dirty!
Fluffy, what's next? Most excellent, my friend. <laughs> the next misplaced artifact is a fossilized bone from the Jurassic dinosaur, Brachiosaurus. Yum, a giant bone. Sorry, fossils are actually hard as stone, so it won't taste very good. <laughs> Darn, we'll bring it back as soon as we can. Yeah, and, whew, was it heavy. What's next? I checked in the exhibit of royal treasures, and the crown of King Henry VIII is missing. Bring it back to me, and we're almost done. One crown coming up. need to find a missing jelly donut. A jelly donut? I'll explain everything when you bring it back. <laughs> Whatever you say, Fluffy. <laughs> Jelly donut. Yeah, that's what it was for. I was really hungry. Excuse me. So how do we get out of London? Well, now we've put all the artifacts back in their proper exhibits, and the night watchman has just opened the back door. <laughs> you can use the back door, and you'll be ready for the next part of your journey, down through the underground and out of London. <laughs> Thanks, Fluffy. Don't eat too many donuts. <laughs> there. Where am I? Greetings, puppy. I am Chester, a rat of fine standing. You are in the London Underground Station, my temporary residence until my studies are complete. Your studies? What are you going to be, a lawyer? Hmm, strange. Everyone presumes that. But, in fact, I intend to become a successful stockbroker. Work my way up out of the gutter, as it were. That's great. Say, someone told me I can get out of London through here. Any ideas? Sometimes the new tube tunnels connect to the old underground waterways. Perhaps if you could find those passages, they would take you where you want to go. Thanks for the info. So, Chester, why aren't some of the lights working? Oh, well... There are short circuits in some of the old electrical lines down here. I say, if you try to use any electrical device down here, who knows what will happen? Anything dangerous? I know for a fact 
that the microphones in the information booth are goofed up. But the only dangerous thing in here is the third rail. Don't touch it while it's on, or you could get hurt. I'll be careful, thanks. Chester. Going for a swim? I don't know. The water looks a little icky, and I'm afraid I'm gonna not swim well enough. Oh, I swim through these waterways all the time, and the water is actually quite clean. I promise that the water is safe for dog paddling, even the big whirlpool further on ahead. A whirlpool? Oh yeah, it's great fun! But be careful of Cruella's robot toys. I saw some of them floating around down there. Okay, I'll see you later. Oh! 
in an old abandoned subway station from the Victorian times. What a discovery! Are we near the exit? Uh, yes, I think so. Try to turn on the lights. I'm sure it will help you find your way out. Thanks a lot, Chester. Maybe I'll see you again someday.
happy.
you be? My name is Shelby. Isn't that funny? Shelby. <laughs> Because of my shell, I kill me. Yeah, I kind of thought that might be the connection. Hey, Shelby, what is this place? Why, this is the carnival, of course. We travel around the world bringing fun and excitement wherever we go. I'm sure you do. Shelby, now you've got me doing it. Hey, is there anything you can tell me about the carnival in just a few short words? Well, you need tickets for some of the attractions, like the roller coaster, the shooting gallery, and the fortune telling machine. You can probably find some tickets just laying around if you look for them. That's great, Shelby. I'll see you later. <laughs> Through the mist of time, I foresee many mysteries await a pouch of magic stardust. This may just be a wild guess, but your new best friend will be ball bearings. It's all about ball bearings. The spirits have contacted me to say your new best friend will be a golden statue of a bull moose. Puppy, I just remembered. There's a strange looking man around here. He's tall, skinny, and ugly. That sounds like Jasper Baden. A real creep, all right. Thanks, Shelby. I'll keep an eye out for him.
Up and it goes down. Right. But are there cool hidden secrets on the roller coaster? Maybe. You'll have to see for yourself. You know, there's a magic wagon around here with a secret. Each time you go into it, you enter a different room. Wow, is it real magic? I can't tell you. As a member of the carnival, I'm sworn to secrecy. <laughs> So much.
Can't hide from me in there, Ront. Hey, where'd he go? Uh-oh. I don't like the looks of this. Who's that? The Poppy? And I do so hate the water. Chester, 
What are you doing out here? Well, I just wanted to make sure you got out of the subway, okay? Besides, my cousin Nigel, uh, he lives out back in the sawdust pile. Well, gee, thanks, Chester. Is there anything you can tell me about this place? Hmm. You might want to turn on any equipment you find around here. The vibrations might shake loose some hidden stuff. Okay, see you later.
faster. How do I get out of here? Do I have to use that crane? Yes, but before you can use the crane, you'll have to find the key. Once you've done that, you can use the crane to move that big log. That's how you reach the exit. I get to operate the huge crane? Cool! Turn. There's Corella again. Osboom, I have the puppy trapped. This new vehicle of yours had better work. I'm not here, my sweet. It's my best invention ever. We're gonna have to figure out some way to stop Corella and fast. Hey, maybe we can use these melons. <laughs>
old Daddy-O. You look like one cool cat. Daddy-O? Cat? But I'm a dog. Who are you? Don't blow your top, Pop. My name is Manny, and my verse is uncanny. Most folks just call me Chasmo. Can you dig it? Uh, nice to meet you, Manny. What's going on around here? Everything is free and easy out here in the sunshine, but you should check out the cave behind the tall waterfall. Thanks for the hint, Manny. that tree house up there, Poppy Child. If you haven't already made the scene, you should be there. Or be square. Okay, I'll check it out. 
You are approaching the Earth's bones, the Standing Stones. The what? Giant rocks and crazy circles. Dig it? But these ones are all jiggly-wiggy. Thanks for the information, Manny. <laughs> Hello again, puppy child. Hi, Manny. Boy, it's great today, isn't it? It is most definitely a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Speaking of hoods, that louse Horace is peddling his perfidy hereabouts. Him again? Don't let the Baden's negative vibes bring you down, Papa Child. Manny has an astute observation to share with you. What's that? Not far from here, you will find a circle of ancient stones. I believe the stones will help you deal with the Horus problem.
Hello, puppy. My name is Priscilla. Hi, Priscilla. Why are you so sad? Well, the lazy farmer around here hasn't been taking good care of the barnyard, so there's lots of stuff that needs to get done around here. That's too bad, Priscilla. Actually, I was just on my way to Corella DeVille's factory, but I keep getting blocked by fences. Do you know how I can get out of here? Hey, I've got an idea. If you help me with some chores, I bet we can get the farmer to open the main gate, and then you can leave that way. Sounds great. What should I do first? Well, I'm real thirsty because the farmer hasn't filled my water trough since yesterday. I think the faucet handle is inside the barn. I think. That sounds easy. I'll be right back. better now that I've had a drink. Thanks. Now, the windmill over yonder needs some fixing. I think a good bark might dislodge the broken board that's preventing the blades from spinning. I think. I'll get right on it. the windmill. You're a great helper. Here's the next chore. The hens are playing outside of their coop and haven't been laying any eggs. Would you please herd the hens back into the coop? Please. How do I do that? By barking at them when they get close to the coop door. Sounds like fun. See you later.
I heard the rooster crowing, so I know he's happy. Congratulations for getting the hens back into the coop. Now there are some farm tools over there in the grain silo that are buried under the grain. If you climb up the silo and jump in, you'll find some switches you can activate to release the grain. Uh, if you're not too busy. Sounds like a challenge. Yeah. <laughs>
impressive. You released all the grain and uncovered the tools. Now for some real fun. The farmer just installed indoor plumbing. <laughs> so he doesn't need his outhouse anymore. <laughs> There's a key in the barn that you can use to start the tractor. <gasps> Drive the tractor into the outhouse to knock it down. Think you can handle that? Huh? You think? I'll be sure to give it my best shot. Thanks a lot. Hey, why are you still sad, Priscilla? Well, it's my birthday today, and uh, no one remembered to get me a present. So if you want to leave now, go right ahead, the gate is open. <laughs> What's a birthday without a present? Hmm, I've got an idea. Oh. 
Oh my, you found a present for me. You're my new best friend. Thanks a lot, Priscilla. I had a great time helping you out. Have a great birthday. <laughs>
Take this! <laughs> That's cool! It's some kind of cannon that shoots snowballs! Maybe I can use it to take out those pesky toy airplanes! Crystal, but I've never skied before. Can you give me any advice? Oh, uh, there's really nothing to it. Just steer left and right and go in between the flags. If you get through all the flags, you can try a more challenging slalom course. Thank you. 
want to try again? Jasper Bandon again. I wonder what he's up to this time. <sighs> Can't chase no puppies on an empty stomach. So first I'm gonna catch me some fish, and then I'm gonna catch me some chips. Hmm. I wonder what chips are made of anyway. I bet if I sneak up close to Jasper, I can give him a real surprise. Okay, here we go. You got to be very quiet when you're a fishing. Hang on, I got me a bite. Easy now, that's it. <coughs> Oi! <coughs> oh, when I get me hands on you. <coughs> Come back here, you stupid dog. Hmm? Uh-oh. Jasper, what a crack-up! <laughs> Easy now, mate. Easy. Whew. Why, you little... <laughs> that Jasper? He's the coolest guy I know. <laughs>
Hello again. <laughs> oh, I guess I still have my cold. Kazuntai, what's this old place? These are the ruins of an ancient castle. Uh, from the Middle Ages, I think. You need to go into the castle and make your way up to the highest tower. Hmm, it looks like the drawbridge is closed. How do I get inside? You'll find switches, like this one, located around the castle. Each switch opens a door, or causes a secret area to be revealed. Sounds simple enough.
This gate is locked from the inside. You're gonna have to go down through the dungeon and look around for a secret entrance. Okay. Thanks, Yvonne. Good work. Once you've finished down here, you should go up to the higher part of the castle. But that's gonna require a little bravery on your part. Uh, what do you mean? The only way to get up there 
is to launch yourself with this old catapult. No offense, Yvonne, but is your cold making you, well, crazy? Oh, it's completely safe, I promise. Just hop on and press your action button. Uh, if you say so, Yvonne. Oh, and once you're up on the battlements, look out for the strong wind. It'll blow you around if you're not careful. Cruella is hiding. Ha! Now I've got that little whelp in my sights. <laughs> Bombs away! <laughs> Uh-oh. I don't know how we're going to get all the way up there. Maybe we can use this old cannibal to knock down the weaker parts of the wall. This wall is barely 300 years old. The good work so far. Now if we can only get the wall low enough, we should be able to clobber Cruella. But the next time we meet will be your doom! Your doom, I say! That was cool! But we better get a move on if we want to make it to the factory before dark. Hi, little puppy! Welcome to the forest! It seems kind of dark and spooky in here. Well, we're getting closer to Cruella's mansion, and it seems like she affects everything around her in a bad way. Any sign of Cruella's henchmen? I haven't seen anything, but now that you mention it, I can smell a trace of La Pelt's cologne. Oh, the palm feet. I'll keep an eye out for him. See you later, Crystal. What are you doing over here, Crystal? I wanted to show you something. 
see this hole in the ground? It leads to a set of underground passages that connects different parts of the forest. You can use it for shortcuts. That's great. Thanks. It's locked. Where's the key? I think the spider might have run off with it. So you might want to look around for some webs. The key will probably be nearby. Thanks for the tip, Crystal. <laughs> You're the greatest. He's certainly too big to get through it. Good luck! Puppy, I have a treat for you. Uh-oh, here comes the pelt. Hello, little puppy. Now you come out of there, right now. Don't make me come in after you! You little monster! Oh no! I am stuck! Someone get me out of here! Help! <laughs> I think Lapel is barking up the wrong tree! My shoes are getting dirty!
Manny. Do you know where we are? I think I'm lost. You may be in a haze, and you are certainly in Cruella's maze. But with the jazz mode, everything's under control. Dig it? Uh, yeah. I dig. Will you help me get through the maze? I will meet and greet along the way. Okay? Great. What can you tell me about the maze? Here's the lowdown. Those crazy DeVille cats built this maze to keep strangers out, dig? To get through the maze, you must learn to turn. Throw a switch, and you're rich, Mitch. So I use the switches to turn the barriers? Thanks, Manny. Daddy-o, here's the switch I was talking about. Got it! Hey, Cat, check this out. Cruella DeVille put thorny traps in here to stop you, dig? But the Jazz Mole knows a secret. What's that? The thorn balls always move along the same path. Learn the path and you can avoid the pain, Jane. Thanks, Manny. See you later, alligator. to put this here for me. What a nice guy. Weird, but nice. <laughs>
Puppet child. Hi, Manny. Am I going the right way? Yes, indeed, hey, Speedy. You are almost done with the fun. That's great news, Manny. I'll see you around. <laughs> Rescue me. Ha 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 ha! 
Hello, friend. Tibbs here again. The Colonel sent me to help you through this area. I'm certain one of the Baden brothers is in the house. So, I'll scout ahead and try to find a good place to set up an ambush. Thanks, Tibbs. See you soon. Here's the plan. I've sabotaged the clock. Just bark at it, and the clock will make a noise to raise the dead. Or at least, Horace. Okay, that sounds easy. Then what? When Horace comes into the room, lead him under the chandelier, and I'll take it from there. Will do. This time, Mutt. Hey, why did the Mutt stop? 
Uh oh. Not the chandelier! <laughs> I guess it's lights out for horrors. <laughs> I hope Jasper's not mad at me. Loser! Feels good to be out of there!
puppy in there. all the way to Cruella's Toy Factory. That's great. How did you get here? Well, actually, I got captured by one of Cruella's toys. It packed me into a crate and dragged me back here. How did you escape? Luckily, I'm skinny. And I was able to squeeze out through one of the crate's air holes. Ouch. So where do we go from here? You need to get past the factory's scary machinery, rescue the last of your brothers and sisters, and make your way to the center of the factory where you will confront Cruella one last time. Is that all? It'll be a snap.
for the robot toy assembly line. Ooh. It looks pretty dangerous to me, Fluffy. Do you have any tips on how I can avoid being crushed like a recycled can? <laughs> Each crusher has its own pattern and timing. I'm sure that if you watch a crusher run for a few seconds, you can learn the pattern and get through safely. Okay, Fluffy. Uh, that's good advice. <laughs>
try jumping on the flat box to get an elevator ride up to the next room. Sure thing. Fluffy, what on earth is it? We're inside Professor Farsboom's electromagnetic experiment chamber. Those cubes out there float on magnetic waves. Can we do anything with them? Yes. Each of these switches will cause a different set of magnets to turn on, arranging the cubes into a unique pattern. You can jump on the cubes after they've been rearranged, but you'll have to hurry. The magnets stay on for only a few seconds. Ha <laughs> ha 
Almost at the end of the level, and Cruella is nearby. <laughs> Get ready, and good luck. Thanks for all the help, Fluffy. little scrapper has made it all the way here to the heart of my toy factory boy she sure likes to hear herself talk <laughs> but your canine karma has come to an end my new super glue cannon will be your demise the boss move turn on the super glue pump <laughs> here it goes Cruella. that sounds like trouble we better do what fluffy said and disable her computers as fast as possible
What is that foul canine up to? <gasps> no matter! It is about to become a plush toy! <laughs> <laughs> Bad feeling about this. <gasps> Let's go find Mom and Dad. Even though she's gone, I can still smell the scent of that Cruella woman. It's like pepper. Achoo. Don't worry, Dotty. All our puppies are safe. And the police will make sure that evil woman won't bother us again for a long, long time. Now let's go home. Well, mates, this might be an opportune time to make ourselves scarce. Ouais, I despise traditional prison apparel. I hear someone a coming. Let's hide. Canine crunchies, can't be beat. They make each meal a 
I wonder what ever happened to Cruella and her henchmen. Yeah, me too. Tell me again, Morn. How long will the gloop keep us like this? Uh, approximately 20 years, my sweet. Not quite as long as their prison sentences. No! <laughs> Is it safe to come out? Boy, that sure was a long trip. Sakurai Blue! Boy, I sure hopes one of you brought sunscreen. <laughs> <laughs>